Hello, I'm Lisa, one of your librarians at the Johnson City Public Library, and this is Ask a Librarian, a web series where you ask questions and I try to answer them. It's always going to be a good one, and I've got a stack of books in front of me. So today we're going to dig into something that I think some of you may have no idea we offer and, and may be really excited to find out. So I'm going to go to the next slide here. Do you have any resources to support book clubs is what that says. And yes, we do. So today we're going to talk about Traveling Tales. It's a book discussion kit that you can check out from the library. We have up to 12 titles, copies of a title in each kit. And we have a great variety of titles you can check out. I'm going to go to the next page here. I'll show you first how to, you, you can check for the list to, to check them out. So I'm going to go to our website, jcpl.org, type in traveling tales and it's going to pull up some results here there are two that are going to interest you so there's the regular traveling tales kit that's what we're talking about here which are more adult geared um, and there's going to be a good variety of fiction nonfiction. then we also have these junior traveling tales which are are meant for school age children so this could be really good if um, you know maybe your child has a group of friends that is missing socializing with them you know maybe you could set up a virtual conference and distribute these books to them and they can have a conversation about vanicula or escape from mr limoncello's library and it's just this nice way to um, read and enjoy and then socialize about these books you know, share that enthusiasm for reading and and reading for fun at a, at a time when, you know, things have been really kind of difficult for all of us right now. And then I'm going to go to this here, which will show you uh, the list of all of the adult books. So we have a good variety of fiction, nonfiction. We have some essay collections. We have, um, you know, a lot of great authors and patch at Barbara King solver. Um, Just Mercy, this was an outstanding discussion um, book. If any of you are interested in, um, you know, maybe learning more about Black Lives Matter and, and the justice system, um, we've got some lighter reads, uh, somewhat lighter. We've got Eleanor Oliphant is completely fine. Um, we've got historical um, works like The Girls of Atomic City up at Oak Ridge, uh, Barbara Kingsolver, The Poisonwood Bible, if you want to discuss something that's kind of a classic. Um, and then, you know, Ron Rash, an essay collection, Nothing Gold Can Stay, or a short story collection, Nothing Gold Can Stay. So just an outstanding, outstanding collection. Oh, man. Gentlemen in Moscow, if you haven't read this book, oh, one of the most beautiful books I've read. So highly recommend it. I think you'll enjoy it, um, you know, you and your friends and family. So the way it works is one of the members of your group, you get a little group of friends together, and one of you will check out a kit with the books in it. You also get a folder with that kit. This is for The Immortal Life of Henry Deluxe, which was another amazing book. And in that folder, you get a checkout list, you get you know, some different resources to help you with leading the discussion, um, including a little biographical note about the author, uh, a bit about the book, if it's won any awards, you know, maybe some of the significance of when it was published, and then some discussion questions to get you guys going, because that can be tricky if you're if you're not used to facilitating a book discussion before. One of the intimidating part, points might be, how do we even get this conversation started? So we do the work for you as far as that goes, and, and um, our librarians have put this together. They're, you know, really just great way to get started with a nice conversation about a, a book and just a fun way to kind of get together right now and socialize. And of course, you can do this virtually through something like Zoom, or you can do this over the phone. You could even maybe have an online discussion board where you read it different times and you and you come together and you know chat to discuss it so it's really I think a, a really cool idea right now um, and you check out the kit for eight weeks which gives you plenty of time to re, you know distribute the books read them and then reassemble them and return them to the library so it's a great resource um, and if you really enjoy it we've got this great list you can keep going with that discussion and and really just develop really nice friendships. We've, we've had our own book discussion groups here at the library and you get to see some really just beautiful friendships develop out of that. So it's a, it's, it's a nice thing. So that has been the question of the week here. So thank you for joining me. If you have a question that you would like to ask, you can go to jcpl.org slash contact us and I'll click on that and just scroll down here, click it on the general question, say, ask a library in the message 
the message section down there. So just I know that it's something you're okay with me sharing. Chances are if it's a question that you have, someone else has it as well. So this is a great way to help that person out. And until next week, I'm Lisa and I'm here to help you. Please send me your questions and I'll talk to you later. Bye.